So it is official, guys. Over the weekend, Dre Michelle revealed that she is pregnant. Now, we're going to skim through this article really fast, and I'm going to show you some three different videos. One's going to be from late last year, where she kind of looked like she foreshadowed this a little bit. And then we're going to get into the opinions of Cameron and Mace and on their podcast, and then Nightcap with Shannon Sharp and Ocho Cinco. So before we get to it, Far into it, don't forget to like, comment, share the video if you like the video. So let's run through this article real fast so we can get into some videos. Drea Michelle seemingly responds to criticism after revealing she is expecting a baby with 22-year-old NBA star Jalen Green. The reality TV star has a son the same age as her boyfriend. So her boyfriend and her son are the same exact age is that disgusting guys comment your thoughts below Dre and michelle is proud to be baking a bun in her oven even if she thinks people don't understand her last week the 39 year old michelle marked international women's day with the exciting news of her pregnancy in an instagram post while some people flooded her with well wishes in her comments section others criticized her relationship with NBA star Jalen Green, 22, as reported by Page Six. This is what she said. This is how crazy she thinks, right? Get comfortable being misunderstood. Only a fraction of people will be able to truly grasp your essence. You're not everyone's, you're not on everyone's timeline of comprehension. She wrote in her Instagram story. She's virtue signaling, trying to create some kind of narrative also it's none of your business how others choose to perceive you most high sees you clearly let that be enough why do these women always have to run to god why do they always bring god in the situations where he clearly didn't decide this she decided this Jalen green decided this so why is she doing all this extra stuff? See, people like this is how you get your religion watered down, right? Anyway, um, okay, let's look at the Instagram post that she posted over the weekend. So she's clearly pregnant. Okay, she's an attractive woman for her age, pretty attractive woman. But is she preying on this young man, using him as a ticket for her lifestyle? Let's see what. Let's share this video because it seems like in this video, she kind of foreshadowed this happening. Here we go. Let's go back to the beginning. Want any more kids or are you done? Oh, yeah, I want more kids. Like how many? Like, like one. I think so like the person you're dating know. you you see like a future with them I think the question you were asking me is if I wanted more kids and I feel like I want more kids and yeah. I feel like at this point in my life right yeah the relationship is is amazing to have right but that's not what I'm basing having a kid on because right. I'm very non-traditional I feel like you can co-parent without being in a relationship. Maybe just two people say, hey, you want a kid? I want a kid. Let's just have a kid. And like, let's just Really? See. So you would, you would I'm do I'm very that. like free spirit. I'm very open. And just... What do you guys think about that? Well, let's let's break this down. Or are you done? Oh, yeah. I want more kids. Okay. She's okay. Look, at, listen to how she responds to these questions. First question, do you want kids? Immediately, yes, 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 yes. Listen to how she reacts as the questions get more direct and specific. Like how many? Like like one, I think. So like the think. person you're dating, you, you see like a future with them? You see the long pause? She's still pausing. I Look at the face, she's looking up for answers. With the long pause, looking up for answers, she's showing deceptive behaviors. And she completely evades the question. Let's go back. 
So like the person you're dating, you you see like a future with them. I think Long pause, looking up at answers. I think the question you were asking me is if I wanted more kids, and I you voice the question. Feel like I want more kids, and yeah. I feel like at this point in my life, right? Yeah. The relationship is is amazing to have, right? But that's not what I'm basing having a kid on. Because right. what are you basing having a kid on? Then the kid needs the man and the woman to balance out the the nurture and the order from the man nurture from the woman the order from the man like what are, what are you, is this how y'all think nowadays i'm very non-traditional yeah we know you're non-traditional i feel like you can co-parent without being in a relationship maybe what i mean you can do it but these people don't give a damn about their kids y'all we just two people say hey you want a kid i want a kid let's just have a kid and like let's just really see. so you would you would do that's so third grade oh man these are the people out here that are parents y'all this is why the family structure is dissipating right before your eyes now let's go into this other video let's see what cameron and them had to say about the subject also fair use shade room fair use fair use also fair use Make sure you guys can see this stuff. Drea and Michelle announced she's pregnant with Houston Rockets player Jalen Green. Drea is 39 and Jalen just turned 22. How do you guys feel about her announcement? Mm. Mm. I'm going to let Killer go first. Let me, let me say this. I love Philadelphia. <laughs> Philadelphia has been extremely good to me my whole life. So, I mean... I'm happy for Drea, actually. Actually, I, I think I think is I'm happy for her. That's what that's what I could start with. Let's see what Killer takes it. These old bitches got it, man. These old bitches, man. These old bitches don't stop, boy. Yo, listen, man. I, the the best way to describe this is that only way I could describe it for what's going on out here is that. These kids, these these young basketball players was kids and they watched these bitches on TV growing up. It's like this murder. It's like, and I'm not saying, and I don't even know if it would be a stat or if I would have a baby with this person or anything, but it's almost like, yo, you know I bag Felicia Rashad, right? <laughs> you, know, you know I got Bill Cosby's TV wife. If we was younger, I'm talking about when we was... 21 to 22. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I got, I got, I went and got Felicia Rashad. You know, I'm like, yo, bro, you can't get mad at the female, first of all. Mm -hmm. Second of all, if Dre announced it, my question is this did he co sign it? That's the question. That's a good, because that's a good, that's a good statement, Killer. It, what is he saying? Right, because, is he happy? Right. If he if he likes exactly. it, pause. I love it. <laughs> That's a decent point. Jalen Green hasn't came out at all to say, "Yeah, I'm the father." None of that. This could be a whole plot twist. Who knows? Who knows? But he hasn't reacted, and that's that's deserving of a question mark. Let's see what Ocho and them had to say before we get out of here. They want to keep you guys going too long. Drea Michelle reveals that she's pregnant with 22-year-old Drea Michelle. Okay. She pregnant? Yeah. What? With 22-year-old Jalen uh, uh, Greens, Houston Rockets. Uh, he's a young, budgeting star. Uh, the 39-year-old model, reality star, and entrepreneur has not confirmed that she and 22-year-old Jalen are expecting a baby girl doing May. They got it on? Yeah. I mean, and people are and people are people like upset. What you upset about? This is two consenting adults. Oh, she. I, he, I think she's thirty nine. People, she's upset 20, about he's twenty two. The age difference. Yeah. Um, I think they're upset about the age difference. I think she got a son. Her son might be twenty two. Huh? You ain't got no problem with that? No, he grown. 
Oh, okay, 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 okay. Now let, let me let me ask you a question. Let me ask yes. you a question. Let's flip it the other way. Mm-hmm. Let's flip it the other way. So if it was a 39-year-old guy with a 22 year old and oh hell. God dang advertisement. Excuse me, guys. All right, let's let's go back just a little bit. So if it was a 39-year-old guy with a 22-year-old and a 22-year-old was pregnant, how would you feel then? Oh, Joe, you already hear him say, when I was talking, we, we'd be talking about a young girl, they'd be calling me creepy. You already right. know it. Well, I'm still going to be creepy. <laughs> I will get me on young one. <laughs> Eat me on oh, young Okay, okay, okay. I, I, I see what you're yeah. saying. I see what you're saying. But, but, but I, I think some, some people would have an issue with it, again, as an athlete. You have to understand. You have to understand the landscape. Understand yeah. the people that you're dealing with. And at times, obviously being 39, forget Drea. Forget Drea in this instance. Forget Drea in this instance. Women that are used to a certain lifestyle, they are used to dealing with a certain caliber of guy, most of the time, in order to get what it is that you want, stay with me now. In order yeah. to get in order to get it what in order to get what you want after reaching the age of 39 and striking out multiple times with dealing with those type of individuals, sometimes. You know, the older ones ain't going to bite no more because they already know what time it is. Yeah. The older ones ain't going to bite no more because they already know what time it is. So what you got to do? You got to go younger. You got to go. The game has always been the game. It's all about knowing how to play it the right way. Oh. Uh, Ocho was cooking with some hot fish grease. He addressed the double standard. We definitely, if men were in that situation and roles were reversed, men would definitely be called and shamed for this behavior. He talks about how older women prey on younger men because the older men in her age group know what kind of game she's playing and they refuse to play it. So this isn't anything new under the sun. All these things have been going on for years so what do you guys think about this? Do you think Jalen Green's to blame because he's being irresponsible? Do you think Dre was preying on this guy just to get her or keep her lifestyle at a certain peak for the next 18 years to get child support? Do you think it's just some stupid, ignorant stuff all around? Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. I appreciate you guys watching to the end. On your way out, please like, comment, subscribe, share the video if you like the video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Forget what corner it is. Don't click off this video. Click the next video. Peace.